only is he the best rapper in Louisiana right now. He the go in and off the streets, in and out the booth. My dog, Fredo Baines, got a lesbian couple, LGBT couple, pregnant. This man's a goat. I can't believe it. I mean, besides, I thought he was over here just dissing the NBA young boy every day. But I turn, I'm turning around and look at this. He got it. And he always talking about studs. I always wondered that. He was like. He, now you know that he really meant it. He really. A lot of people thought it was jokes. You know, people joke around and say whatever in their songs because it's a good tagline. But. He really, he really living by his words. I thought it was like a strange little fetish. Like who, like who fetishes about like turning us? But I guess I mean, hey, Fredo Banks, live your life. You the goat. I'm trying to be like you when I grow up. Yeah, apparently they're famous. Who are these girls? Yeah, they're like, uh, what are those like TikTok? Fit, fitness influencers or whatever? Mm, makes sense. Makes sense. Makes. I wonder how he got pregnant. You think they gonna say it in the video? Oh, he got them both pregnant, right? Oh, he the goat, goat. He on Michael Jordan level. If he did that. I don't know. I think, no, maybe he got one of them. I wonder which one. Let's see. Do they talk about it in the video? Oh, let's see. So I know there's a lot of confusion because we do have two kids, Parker Boy, and guys. Peyton. Um, a lot of people have heard of the brand Parker by Peyton. We actually created it and named it after our kids and who we manifested before they came, of course. Um, but as far as Peyton goes, I can confirm that Fredo Bang is the biological father of Peyton, however, he is not the biological father of Parker, um, whom my wife carried in 2021. And we had to try three times for Parker, um, which was just like the cr craziest thing. Um, the first time I actually Craziest. Found out, it was, it's really hard. The first time I three found times? out I had polycystic oh, okay. syndrome, when we went to the fertility specialist, I thought I was just going to be able to easily get pregnant. Um, and went, that's when I started like documenting our whole entire journey of our RUI process, which is on our YouTube, uh, being the buffins because it was really hard. Like the first time was devastated when I found out I just couldn't easily get pregnant. Like I thought the second time was super devastating. Yeah. See, and that's the thing about the IU. Oh yeah. The IU is, um, people use this to get pregnant. See, and it's not, and that's, I always tell people that it's but not always, out, I thought they were saying IUD. No, no, no. IUD. No, IU, an IUI. I mean, IUI. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people say they can do this, like, if you don't, I guess, like, if you don't want to go the regular route, you can go this route. And a lot of people that's having, like, fertility problems. I guess, yeah, yeah, route. they get it. Uh, what is it? In vitro uh, mm -hmm. fertilization or some something like that. Um, but, um, but yeah. I mean, he tried three times, so he, he got that. So what's got great, what's funny is that, well, not funny, but, like, it's crazy. It's like the, the girl who, uh, let's just say, takes on more of the girl role, that she had trouble um get pregnant. pregos mm -hmm. and then the stud was the one that got pregos when they were just having fun with fredo banks are you serious for real yeah she's the stud said she had the fredo bank baby so fredo bang was probably messing with both of them but it looks like the the one the other one has a hard time and he ended up getting the uh the stud pregnant is that part of the handbook can they do that what i thought only i thought the stud couldn't get this is just crazy yeah because remember they we had those photos where she was pregnant she had those like maternity photos the stud that was see yeah you gotta pay attention you can't trust him you can't trust him see he thought he was safe he thought the stud got it turned off she left it on that's the service but i mean i mean congratulations to y'all you know craig congratulations to them yeah they the wanted a baby this is something they wanted would you so. do this would you um get get a get a get a couple of baby would you go to the sperm bank i mean if they if they needed do someone to donate i mean you donate every day look, for free no, that, no matter what you must they, get paid and uh, they, uh, you know, they don't mind. I don't mind. I'll do the time. Like Fredo Bang. <laughs> oh, man. But, I mean, shout out to my dog, Fredo Bangs. He out here doing his thing. Hey, we got to start. I wonder if they charge for that. What? Getting paid? We charge like a 5K a donation. And you can have a baby. Nobody wants your, nobody wants your sperm. I, we're, I'm, we're not little people. People would, would love to get our man fluids. Ain't you like 5'7"? No, never in my life. I will dunk on you for the disrespect. I'm definitely. I'm, Nobody wants a five seven kid, Kyle. No, I'm not five seven. Calm down, Kyle. Uh, I'm definitely six six one. You're the one that's uh, over there. That's like five six. Make it make sense. Look, you can see right now who's taller. This guy. And you we can see we're sitting in the chairs that are identical chairs. Who's taller? You maybe. I'm spitting nothing but facts, baby. You may be sitting taller in a chair, but we already know who not who not.